Well, we want to tell you about history being made last night in a small town in Georgia. Nearly 60 years after Brown versus the Board of Education desegregated the nation's schools, teens in one community held their prom. And for the first time, this one was different from all the others. Ron's back with this story. Here. Yeah, it really, it's really stunning to believe that it took until this year before a group of teenagers broke down a racial divide that most communities eliminated decades ago. Last night, the students at a rural high school in Georgia put on dresses and tuxes and held their first integrated prom. Overnight students at Wilcox County High School were celebrating their prom night with a little extra enthusiasm. For any teenager, a prom is a monumental occasion. But for this Georgia high school, this prom has been over 40 years in the making. For the first time ever, the rural community's high school students danced together at a prom that wasn't segregated. For decades, the county school board has avoided officially endorsing prom festivities, instead relying on parents to host their own events and that way control the invitations. That led to two dances year after year, one for white students, one for black students. And it's just time for a change, and we have it this evening. And that's good. Some students have lobbied over the years to end the practice of segregated proms. This year, a group of Wilcox County seniors decided to take matters into their own hands. The four girls, two black, two white, created this Facebook page, Integrated Prom, asking for support for their cause and donations to fund an independent bash open to everyone. We were doing that so that we could get the word out and so that some people would begin to donate and help us out with what we were doing. <laughs> Saturday night, nearly half of the high school's student body turned out for the integrated prom, making memories that will last a lifetime. But despite this year's groundbreaking integrated dance, there was once again this year a segregated prom attended only by white students from that high school. It wasn't officially sanctioned event but a private one organized by the white parents for the white kids. baffling when you say groundbreaking yeah, in 2013. Amazing, it? Yeah, 2013. All right, Ron. Thanks, One Ron. school at a time. Yeah, okay. slowly, apparently. Thanks. Very slowly.